there's two different aspects to this. There's the collectible sort of uh, piece of this where um, it's feeding sort of feeding your your inner 12 year old when you were shilling uh, cards at the market, Correct. all that kind of stuff. And then there's the businessman who's looking at and the investor is looking at the companies in and of themselves. What and, I then wanna, and then there's yeah. also Gary Vaynerchuk, the human being. Let me explain. Yes, this absolutely. Piece, this piece of art is from Lise Bartlett. She worked for Barn, She worked for me at Vayner. I like her. Her husband worked for, with me at Resi. She's making a big risk and going on her own. This is expensive by my art standards. I bought it because I love her. Yeah. I'm, I'm excited because I'm meeting a lot of artists on Twitter and discords. I'm excited to be the humanitarian. That's how I see it. I, yeah. Or the kind person. Like I'm excited to buy art based on, I like you, the human. My natural instincts around art go much more into like what I'm doodling, which is I care about the Smurfs and Punky Brewster and, and Max Hedrum and Robocop and TMT. Like I like, those things more than like a beautiful, yeah. you know, and but, 70s or 80s pop culture. Group I'm a you pop grew culture guy. Yeah. And so I want to do that, which lends, you know, which is different than seeing some beautiful sketch yeah. or like paint. I don't like Jackson Pollock. Yeah. I don't Everybody like Everybody has their own, their own artistic interests. And I remind a lot of people who are listening, people are like mm -hmm. trying to force people to like a oh. certain thing. It makes me laugh. Like why? I, I, I talk to, I, I think of myself as a coach um, and a teacher. I invite a lot of artists that are new to the space, come in, talk to me, DM me. Let's, let's talk about this space. They're in here for a month and they're like, Eric, I'm not getting any sales. And I'm like, uh, first, let's think about what are you doing? Well, I'm just posting links on Twitter. I'm like that's, you're not doing enough. Doing you're anything. not doing enough. Yeah. I mean, I that's like waking up in the morning. It's if you're an artist 100%. posting a link of your art to an open C account or whatever, that is literally like saying, I've woken up this morning. Cool. Yeah. Now what? 100%. Yeah. And I, I, so, my, my big thing is it's community building. Yeah. I talk about connection a lot. Uh, not, commun not, not communicating. It's the, same, it's the same thing. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. Same exact thing. And it's who is your audience? Find 20 or 30 people that are going to talk to you, going to, going to be with you and act and connect with you daily. That's all you need. 20 or 30 Absolutely people. Right. And, and, to... and, 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 and how much do you care about them versus caring about you? Every artist yes. I'm talking to is like, I want to sell this for 800 bucks. I'm like, what's in it for the other person? Right. And, right. and there's two ways. Again, it's art and commerce. Yeah. Is this something that you are going to like you, have, if you're doing this for collecting, flipping, with, you know, again, and I went through this recently with sports cards over the last four years, nobody gets to decide what another human being, like, I love how people are like, like they're trying to be dictators and communists. I'm like, <laughs> I'm like, I'm like, you're telling me I have to collect art for the sake of the art and never sell it? Who right. gave you that power? I have to tell you to look at this as an investment where you just like having a wallet to display? Who am I? Right. And I, by the way, I'm gonna do both but I'm gonna do mine. It's why I brought up the Elise thing. I'm yeah. gonna support artists that I have a an actual connection to from a human standpoint, Yes. not to their art because I've never been affected by art that way, comma, the art that I'm incredibly affected by is character creation. Like mm -hmm. I bought Magic the Gathering cards when they first came out. I like, like that's what I- Were you liked. into Pokemon too? Did you buy those I was cards? A, I was a hair, uh, at that point I'd really started my career and I was like 100% yeah. trying to build my dad's liquor store. But my brother AJ is 11 years younger. And when he got like massive strep throat and like real sick, I went to the card store. My dad and bought him a box of the original Pokemon. Oh my God, yes. yes. Uh, we always talk about that. So. But yes, I understand Pokemon. I'm obsessed yeah. with WWFE. I understand why Disney works. I think, and then I care about like funny little ones like the Snorks or the Get Along Game yeah. or the Wuzzles. Like I, so I think everyone gets to pick.